But big data is about more than just catching buses. Joining us now from the German IT Association, Bitcom, is Joachim Bühler. Mr. Bühler, thank you for coming in. First of all, run us through some of the delights of big data. Yes, for example, you can see on the website in real time whether your flight that you want to book for your next holiday or whatever will increase or will raise. So you can decide whether to book the flight today or in a week when it's maybe cheaper. This is a big data analytics. And you can also see in real time uh, how many seats are left, so oh, the yes. pressure is on. Yes. How much would you say companies are actually benefiting or saving through big data? Well, the potential is very high. Let's give you an example. Um, if you have a small shop in a village and you want to know whether you buy fresh fruits for Saturday, there is a family coming, you know, doing their weekly shopping. Well, you, there, there are so many factors who influence the buying of the family, like the weather is fine, mm -hmm. there are some events around there. And with beta, big data analytics, that helps you to calculate your 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 fruits or whatever better mm -hmm. so that you can save money and make it more efficient. So you have all that information at your fingertips, basically. Also, there's an improvement in products. The products are there for the customer. Yes, definitely. You can optimize your products. You can see whether when the product will, will break, for example. If you have uh, like tires, then you have big data analytics that show you when exactly in which time the tire will go flat. And then you can, before the tire will be flat, you can change it. And that's very helpful. Hopefully before getting onto the auto bus. Yes. <laughs> Let's take a look at some of the figures as far as internet activity goes. Every minute, users around the world gobble up a hundred hours of video material on YouTube. They make about four million searches on Google, over three million Facebook entries and 350,000 tweets. Do we have any control over the data, all that data collected by, not just by us, but by companies? Yes. Well, actually, yes, we do. And big data analysts are one instrument to help us to get orientation in this big data fluid. Yes, mm -hmm. you can, you know, you can, use the data now and uh, this is one of the big advantages of big data and uh, for your own data protection sure you have to you know you have to say yes to use your data and you have to be careful where you you give your data to and where you use it but briefly the data protection laws that are in place from the european commission for example do they do a lot Yes, they will. Well, hopefully they will come. They are actually not, uh, at the moment we don't have them. And, they're still uh, not in they, place. They're still not in place. Yeah, and we hope that will be in place in, in the next year. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and we hope that there will be, yes, there will be better protection in the next year.